for today is about addition and subtraction of fraction. Okay, let's start. First, addition of fraction with same denominator. So how do we add fractions with the same denominator? Let's do example number one. We have here 1 over 3 plus 1 over 3. So how do we solve? We have the denominator, which are the same, 3 and 3. Therefore, the denominator of the answer is 3. And then, the numerator, we add. So 1 plus 1 is equals to 2. Therefore, the, the answer is 2 over 3. <clears throat> Next. Example number 2. We have 3 over 10 plus 6 over 10. Again, same denominator. So the denominator of the answer is always 10. And then for the numerator, we add, simply add the numerator. So six, 3 plus 6 is equals to 9. So the answer is 9 over 10. Okay, next, another example. We have 1 over 7 plus 4 over 7. Again, same denominator. So the denominator of the answer is 7. And the numerator, we, ju we just add 1 plus 4 is equals to 5. So, 1 over 7 plus 4 over 7 is equals to 5 over 7. Okay. Next, addition of fractions with different denominator. So, this time, it, the denominator is not the same. So, example number 1. We have 1 half plus 1 fifth. As you can see, the denominator is different. So what do we do? We multiply. So 2 times 5 is 10. So the, the denominator of the answer is 10. And then we cross multiply. 2 times 1 is 2. And the other is 5 times 1 is 5. From there, we have 5 and 2, we simply add. So 5 plus 2 is equals to 7. Therefore, 1 half plus 1 fifth is equals to 7 over 10. Okay, example number 2. We have 2 over 3 plus 1 over 7. Again, different denominator. So what do we do? We multiply the denominator. So we have the denominator is 21. So the, the, the denominator of the answer is 21. So we solve for the numerator. 3 times 1, 3. And 7 times 2 is 14. So having these numbers, we simply add the numerator, which is 14 plus 3. We have 11. Therefore, 2 over 3 plus 1 over 7 is equals to 11 over 21. Easy? Next example. We have 3 over 7 plus 2 over 5. Again, different denominator. So what do we do? Multiply. So 7 times 5, we have 35. So the denominator of the answer is 35. Now, for the numerator, again, we cross multiply. 7 times 2 is 14. And 5 times 3 is 15. And then, we add. So 15 times 14 is 29. Therefore, 3 over 7 
plus 2 over 5 is equals to 29 over 35. Now, we proceed to subtraction of fractions with same denominator. Now, we, su we subtract fraction, but same denominator. So, what do we do? Example number 1, we have 4 over 5 minus 2 over 5. So, here we have same denominator. So, the denominator of the answer is also 5. And then we simply subtract the numerator. The same we do in addition. But this time, we subtract. So 4 minus 2, we have 2. So 4 over 5 minus 2 over 5 is 2 over 5. Okay, example number 2, we have 9 over 11 minus 6 over 11. So since we have same denominator, so the answer uh, the, the, the answer is 11. So the denominator of the answer is 11. And then the numerator we simply subtract. So 9 minus 6, we have 3. Therefore, 9 over 11 minus 6 over 11 is equals to 3 over 11. Another example, 11 over 15 minus 7 over 15. Again, same denominator. Therefore, the denominator of the answer is 15. And then, the numerator, we simply subtract 11 minus 7 is 4. Therefore, 11 over 7 uh, 11 over 15 minus 7 over 15 is equals to 4 over 15. Now, subtraction of fraction with different denominator. So, example number 1, we have 1 half minus 1 fifth. It, since we have different denominator, what do we do? We multiply. So, 2 times 5 is equals to 10. So, the denominator of the answer is already 10. Now, we cross multiply. 2 times 1 is 2. 5 times 1 is 5. So, we subtract the numerator. 5 minus 2 is equal to 3. Therefore, 1 half minus 1 fifth is equal to 3 tenths. Sample number 2. We have 1 half minus 1 seventh different denominator we multiply so the denominator of the answer is 14 and then we cross multiply 2 times 1 is 2 7 times 1 is 7 and then we subtract 7 minus 2 is equals to 5 so 1 half minus 1 7 is equals to 5 over 14 example number 3 we have 3 over 7 minus 2 over, fi over 5. <clears throat> Different denominator, we multiply, we have 35. And the numerator, cross multiply. 7 times 2 is 14, and 3 times 5 is 15. So we subtract these numbers. 5 minus 14 is equals to 1. Therefore, 3 over 7 minus 2 fifth is equals to 1 over 35. Okay. So again, addition with same denominator, keep the denominator, just simply add the numerator. Addition with different denominator, multiply the denominators, and then cross multiply, then add the numerator. Subtract <coughs> Subtraction with same denominator, keep the denominator, just simply subtract the numerator. Subtraction with different denominator, multiply the denominator, then cross multiply, then subtract the numerator. Okay, so what's next? Guess what? Homework. Okay, so try solving this after this video. Okay, again, this is Teacher Gang. And I hope you learned from our lesson for today. 
Okay, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. Bye!